Hi, this is Ed Nunez for the Lone Star Conference Media Day. With us today are Western New Mexico women's head coach Josh Pace and also senior Cassandra Vickery from Tularosa, New Mexico. Welcome to both of you. Thanks for having us. You know, coach, last year is a challenge for everybody. You had to play all your games outside the state of New Mexico. Mm -hmm. uh, this is your second full year as the head coach of Western New Mexico. What are your expectations for your team this year? Well, like you said, last year was a very challenging year for us. We were only able to get four games in because of COVID. But um, the good thing about that was we were able to spend a lot of time in the gym practicing. And we had a very young team last year. We got a young team this year. But we got some good chemistry, um, got good leadership, good experience in terms of student athletes who have been in, been in the program before, like Cassie Vickery, who um, is going to have a big role this year. So we are looking forward to you know, showing our growth, you know, there are going to be some bumps in the road, but I think everybody's going to be excited about the potential that we have and the culture that we've built so far. Coach, you know, you mentioned the practice and the rep, rep, uh, reps, right? Uh, you played four games, but talk about how important that is. I think a lot of times people just want to go out and play. You've got to do the defense, the box out, just the fundamentals of the game, the free throw shooting, a defensive off the ball, drawing charges. There's so many little, little things that you have to, to work on as a team. Mm -hmm. So talk about how that time may have benefited your team and how we'll see that on the floor this year. Well, it's funny you say that because boxing out, help side, jump to ball, communication, these are all things that they hear me saying every single day in practice. And I know they're tired of hearing my voice, tired of hearing me barking at them about it, but um, it's very important, especially in this type of conference that we're in, the Lone Star Conference, which is one of the better conferences, Division II conferences, obviously, in the country in all sports. And we want to be a competitor in this conference. So um, uh, getting the reps last year was very important, them getting used to my coaching style and um, – just hearing me every day and getting the repetitions on both ends. We don't just focus on offense. We don't just focus on defense. We want to be a good team um, when it comes to both of those aspects of the game. And I think we're headed in the right in the right direction. Kind so of like a, a full season of a training camp, really. Uh, Cassandra Vickery, you know, the senior from Tularosa. You know, you hurt your knee a couple years ago. You've had a season and a half really to recover. Where where are you at with that knee now, and how do you feel? Oh, I'm extremely confident. It doesn't bother me. It. I feel like I'm at least at 95% of where I was my sophomore year, which was the one season that I got to play and I felt great. And I feel even better now, especially with having a better team that's been able to push me, support me, a coach that supports me and looks out for the, looks out for the better for me. And I'm just really confident in myself. Coach talked about leadership. You're, you know, you're a senior and you know, the, the leadership part from seniors and the people that have been in the battle. Yes. Talk a little bit about the leadership that you provide as a senior, you, you know, you, you hope the younger class, upper, uh, young, younger freshmen and sophomores are emulating as uh, uh, an example from you. Oh, yes. So having experience in this conference, I have to show that to the girls and know that they cannot get complacent. This conference is no joke, as everyone knows that, that has played in it. And I have to make sure that I represent that as a leader and knowing that I've played in this conference and I have to show that to them that we have to take every day serious. We cannot take no days off. There's, there's no time for that. And that's one of the leadership roles that I must take. Uh, awesome. Coach, you know, talk about uh, what newcomers we might expect to see an impact from this season. Well, last, last year you didn't really get an opportunity to see our um, – last year's incoming freshman class. Um, but we have Alina Simon, who's a really good guard. She's gonna handle the ball a lot this year. Probably one of our better defenders along with Cassie. Uh, she's still growing into the role and learning how to play the game on this level. But um, very good athlete. She's gonna be really good. You're gonna hear that name. Zion Smith, who is a transfer from Mesa Community College in Arizona. She was here last year as well, but again, four, four games. Um, our community, our area didn't get opportunity to see how skilled she will be. Can play multiple positions from one through four, defends both, uh, defends really well one through four as well. So um, those are two names that I think you can hear, expect to hear a lot, um, and two names that you'll be very proud of. And obviously we got, in terms of our veteran leadership, we have Cassie Vickery, uh, Kayla Chavez, who's one of the better shooters in the conference. Destiny Johnson, who didn't play two years ago as well. She had a baby. Um, played a little bit last year, but versatile at the four and five. Can handle the ball, can shoot, can defend multiple positions as well. Um, we have a senior, Kai Couch, who will be um, representing for uh, New Mexico as well. One of the Mexico student athletes that are here on our team. And a really good shooter. She's gotten better since uh, I've been here. And I'm looking forward to her minutes, seeing what she does with her minutes. But um, just, just a whole different team overall, something that I think um, 
we haven't seen here in a while. We're going to push the ball up the floor. We're looking to score first before we get into our offense, but we do have a half-court offense that we will use. Uh, there's no restraints on their games. They're allowed to just hoop and play. You know, I'll tell them when it's a bad shot, mm -hmm. you know, things like that. But um, they're going to play. They're going to hoop. We're going to get the experience as we go. And like I said, there are going to be some ups and downs, but I think um, uh, competitively we will be a different type of team than we've seen in the last last few years for sure. A couple more questions and we'll wrap it up. Do you feel that you have the defensive guards to apply the pressure that you want in the, the wing pressure to get the easy baskets in transition and, and the rebounding underneath? Do you feel that you have the personnel to do that? Absolutely. We're young, but we're talented. Uh, we've, we've done a really good job recruiting um, bigger, bigger guards, bigger forwards to be able to do some switches in defense um, in this conference, which you have to do. These teams are very good, very competitive, very athletic. They're smart. They're experienced. Um, we're not as experienced as these other teams, but we're going to get to that, that experience this year. And um, you, you, got, you guys are going to see a different type of uh, Western New Mexico University women's basketball team on the court. For sure. Sandra Vickery, you want to wish you good luck. Josh Pace also want to wish you good luck for the upcoming season. This has been Ed Nunez along with Western New Mexico women's head coach Josh Pace, senior Cassandra Vickery from Tularosa, New Mexico for the Lone Star Conference Media Day.